Good morning, guys. It's Dan the Medic. Welcome to the channel. Now, today I'm at the Sea Day brunch on the Carnival Venezia. Now, I'm guessing this is not available on port days. Who knows these things, guys? Anyway, must scan to see the menu. It's brunch, guys, so coffee is included. Hi. Yes, I'll have your uh, plain grits. Mm. I'll have your uh, uh, salmon, lux salmon. Yes. A side of um, bacon. And then for dessert, the seven layer chocolate cake. And I guess that's it, yeah. All right. This menu is hard to navigate. Arr! The sea. So guys, believe it or not, I was up all night editing videos and at 6 in the morning I wanted to go to sleep but I couldn't which is why I am awake for brunch So I'm noticing on the table that they have a very bizarre way of presenting the utensils Look at this guys Isn't that strange? It is kind of like risque, you know, that like you can imagine like the the dancing woman showing the leg, like woohoo, kind of like that. Good morning, Mister Lee. How are you? Good. Hi. How is everything? Good. And how are you? I'm doing fine. Enjoy, okay? Okay. They know my name, guys. I thought I was in trouble. So, while we're waiting for the breakfast to come, I'll tell you what I think of the food on this cruise so far. Had a few meals and stuff like that. So, I find that the food here, I have to put it on a, like a spectrum, right? So about 1% it's like really really good about 70% is good and about 20% meh you know which is a like a lot of good not enough like super good you know like I remember I was on the MSC Meraviglia and they have a very small percentage that is good but out of that percentage, they had some like really awesome Indian curry. It was so good, guys. Delicious. Wait, oh, was that the escape? I don't know these things, guys. So while we're waiting for the breakfast, I'll tell you about the bed in my room. All right, so the bed is of a kind of like a metal cage chicken wire type support right which is good i like it nice and flat the mattress is a little bit on the hard side you know you got like soft medium hard that kind of thing it's a bit on the hard side but it was comfortable you know i i, I would like it a little bit softer but it is comfortable guys and it is two twins making up a king size bed that is roomy guys so I, I slept pretty good on the, you know, when I did sleep. And boy, you know, it's like, it's a big, big change from that, you know, the other cruise I took with the weird bed that just wasn't, wasn't, uh, wasn't really good. But so the bed on this 
Pretty darn good, guys. Pretty darn good. You know, I could like spread my arms and legs and everything. Excellent. And I didn't fall through the crack in the middle. You know, to be honest, this is looking a lot faster than 21 miles per hour. So on today's menu, they did the same pattern. They sprinkled in the stuff you have to pay for in with the free stuff. Guys, there was uh, one section where I looked and said, like, ooh, shrimp and grits, and then said, like, oh, it costs money. Ah. Guys, I mean like, like I said in the previous video, it's good for the business, you know, uh, like good for the company. but. I don't know, I, I, I would prefer like a separate listing, you know what I mean? So I could just avoid the paid stuff altogether, you know? But, you know, like it, it, it does work, you know? I saw the shrimp and grits mixed in with everything else and it's like, ooh, that sounds so good. And then, ooh! Now, if I wasn't such a cheap SOB, I, I might have gone for the shrimp and grits and they would have made six bucks. All right. Now, it's not just that they make six bucks, right? Because if I didn't order the shrimp and grits, right, then I would have eaten the free stuff. So not only did they make $6, they saved on the free stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah. Food's coming any minute now. What could be in here? It doesn't even open up. It's not it's not a twist cap. Maybe it's a shaking thing. I don't know. Oh. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Food's here, guys. Let's take a closer look. It's looking pretty nice. Good presentation. Alright guys, so first the grits. Wow, thick and chunky. So nice grits. Eight for the grits. Put some bacon in it. This must be Italian bacon or something. Reminds me of that ham that they leave around for a long time. I think it's called prosciutto. Hmm. Very Italian. So this bacon, give it a seven and a half. Now, I used to work for either McDonald's or Burger King, right? And over there, they had these like a sealed pouches of bacon bits. 
that you tear open and you sprinkle on your salad. That's like this, you know. It's that kind. It's like real bacon, but crumb, crumbly. It, it's like it's like kind of like that. All right, I can tell you right now, they are a little bit skimpy with the smoked salmon. Like here's this huge bagel. Let me test out the bagel. It's an okay bagel. Like seven and a half, it's all right. Okay, so. Let's try to smoke salmon. It's okay tasting. It's not as orange and translucent as I would like it to be, but you know, things are different. All right, so I guess this is the cream cheese. Right, so I want to smear the cream cheese. As a matter of fact, I think I only have enough smoked salmon for half a bagel. Might as well cut the bagel in half. There we go. Put some cream cheese here. Gotta un unfold this thing here. They folded it into a into a ball. So I've slice here. Let me tuck it in. Alright, so my resulting sandwich, which is a, uh, you know, enough salmon for half a bagel. Alright, I'm sure I can ask them for another serving, they would bring it, so it's not really an issue. It's good. Give it an eight. I hate these utensils. Keep falling. So now I got the grits with the bacon in it. It tastes like grits with bacon in it. All right, pretty satisfying breakfast over there. Uh, now we're just gonna wait for the dessert that I ordered of which I don't remember what it was. Hmm. Not enough sleep last night. I was uh, editing videos. Hmm. 
So, I'm just curious guys. Are you able to scan this? Put it in the comments below. Thank you. Okay. Let's take a closer look. Okay, so let's give this cake a try. I like this, guys. It's like a mouthful of chocolate. Nine for this cake. It's very light and fluffy. Like got a lot of air in it. I bet I can compress this. I was able to compress it maybe 30%. Delicious. Mm. Mm. All right. So, New Vegas video every Friday.